Hello, hello, hello everyone. Welcome, welcome to my channel. My name is Veronica Castillo and you crochet with Lama V. Welcome everybody. So uh, real quick um on this video and hopefully this video motivating you to get your uh scrappy yarn your stash yarn get ready because it's gonna be two videos and the video number two just real quick mention um and the video number two i will be share with you some uh, pictures uh, some um ideas that i find in this app that we can crochet together you know um using the scrappy yarn and uh, like I said, there's so many pictures that I will show you. And, you know, if you like to look for any other ideas, well, fine. You know, this the, the app, you, you can have so ton of different pictures for other people. Um, one of the tools you need is this one right here. And I will put the link where I get this one. And I'm not selling. I'm not feeling. I'm just one of the great tools that I like to use and share with you. And it worked for me. And hopefully it's worked for you. Um yeah so get your favorite drink get your snack and of course get your whips okay so i got it here want oh uh, what the bag you see this is a bag and this is another one that i have all kind of yarn scrappy yarn um let me show you this one so quick okay um i was doing a, a bag you know that i was using the scrappy um uh, scrappy yarn or leftover yarn so i got still have some more in here this is one of the basket now i got this one separately but the other one isn't even not i see what i can do with that one um but this one is kind of like a dark colors like you know uh orange red browns and stuff like that um so yeah like these colors but i think this one can go with that one i don't know so um this is some of the scrappy yarn and also you know what let me put this one first in here and okay so I got some in here. It's not a lot in this right here. Um, but what did I did before, you know, I was trying to organize the colors. I think I already showed this one in one of my videos that I did this bag, you know, like to show you what I what I was working on. Um so this one is kind of like a pastel colors, you know, can go like together and I'll just try to put it in different basket so here is the one this one i'm gonna say i know i have some more in that bag that i will show you in a minute and look i have this pink this this one can go in this basket i don't have no more in this color now um on this one um this one I'm, is is 100 percent sure is big twist yarn and so you know what i'm gonna do i have no idea but he said all of his one and i have some more in here that i had to choose and decide because this one is kind of more dark colors you can see like the golds and like this one you know um some and brown like this look at these three colors really go matched together really nice this one i'm probably I don't know, but I think this one I have some more. So this one let's go be back over there. Um let me let me see if I can find the um let me grab it. So this is the one 
so i'm not gonna put in on um, the scrappy because um, i still have three or four more of these so whatever i can do with this one let's go back over there um this is this is new i didn't even use this one on um, and this three i had three in here see i mean i mean this one is gonna be good for a big project i don't know what i was using this one before so i had to remember and see i got this one i don't have no more fish on this one you can find on hobby lobby and oh i have some more extra here these two this one can go in one of the projects okay on these i don't know what is this but oh and also i have some so many labels so many labels oh wow I have some more in here. Just gonna go in the pastel, even it's a it's a little bit. And I got this one. This one go on here. On oh, this one, I don't know about this one, but this one is kind of like this the same, the same match. Um, I see if I will even in the pastel colors. This one go with the dark, dark color. This is new. This is an even touching this one. So, but all this one is gone and the dark color. Um, this one's two. And also I have cotton. I have cotton scrappy yarn too, but I need to working and that depends what I'm gonna do, right? So it's empty. Um what I have these three colors right here. Um so what I'm gonna do is try and put in like organize and let's see how they go. But like I say I had some mark more in here, right here in the wall and also on the other side of the wall that one is cotton. So let's work in um so look at this one right here these three colors when this one i can add in any other color like brown and kind of like a blue you can see that white or green but see right here it can be one project i don't know you know so this this one is i'm gonna put it in the dark color basket um let's see so i got like i said i got the basket like pastel colors like a you know some not too dark and they can be match okay i had this one so that means this one let me put this one because this, this one is a little bit more dark but it's okay um and see Oh, let me show you the big bag that I have. Okay, so. Oh, boy. Okay, this bag I got on, on Hobby Lobby. Um, and this is the bag. This is what they say. Get all, get all, Lauren, all my stash. So, it's a huge big bag. Oh boy, <laughs> I don't want to do it. I don't even want to start it. But one thing I need to do it because it's a big old mess. And like I said, you see right there, that is, um, let me see, try it. Oh, I have some chocolate. This is one that I like sometimes. Just a little piece. I like dark chocolate. What is your favorite snack when you just relaxing, watching videos, watching YouTube videos? you know, crochet or organize your stash or whatever you like to do, right? So, um, so let's start it. You see, I had like a chunky yarn right there. So, and like I was talking about, all this right here is acrylic. This is all acrylic. And, and this one is not mixed with the cotton. The cotton is on the other side. So, 
and also I had a basket on cotton yarn and here on the side of me um I put it in here because I was working on bags and I was using uh cotton this one right here this is all cotton and this is cotton 100% cotton different colors and I try to leave it just the label if you know but I know what it is, which one it is, which one is the, you know, um, the yarn, where the yarn come and come from, or, you know, and here's another one. This is really extremely soft. This is hobby yarn. And I got some cakes in here. Just like that. I try to put it organized like that. See, because like I said, I was working on some project. This is so beautiful. Of course, this one, I'm not going to mix with this one because this one is soft and this one is not. But, um, you know, this one is soft. Like, this one is soft. So, all these, I'll just put it together. You know, whatever, even if it's not match. But this is scrappy yarn. Because you can see there's different colors that I don't have much on that. So, and this one is the same brand as this one so yeah so i try and kind of match the colors so when you're making your cakes try and match um this one that's different right this one is different so of course this one let's go with this one like this together and i think i have some oh this color right here it one didn't match but you know it is just for a small project. Whatever you like to crochet. This is new. I don't know what she's doing in here. Um, and I'm trying to see. Because like I said, I was I was working all the day with this yarn. And like I said, here is a yellow. A little bit, bit yellow. So like I said, even this color didn't match. But, you know, they can be go with like a small basket or something. Um, this one, this one is 50% cotton, if I'm not wrong, is, let me see, no, 69% cotton and 31% acrylic, but I will put in on cotton, but of course, I'm not going to put in on something, because you can see this yarn is totally different, they have like a little ball pop right here, so this one i will be crochet so this is how much i got in cotton in, in the basket just right now uh, like i said i put it, this one in here when i'm working on something i just grab it and you know as i was working on some um, flowers like this i also had a tutorial how you can do this so i will put it in my description box below and this one i don't like to match or put it in some so this one is this one is this one right here. This one is this kind of yarn. This is the one. But I just you know I had to put it together in a cake, something like this. So but this is the beauty of course. So I need to organize my stash and put it over there with the cotton over there and acrylic over here or in the back um let me try and put this up and you're gonna see working with me maybe and i want to talk but you know um but this one that's going over there i'll bring it down here because i'm trying to match this one over there and let me put this one together right and i will i will put all the yarn from this bag and see what i can do with all these stash right here so stay tuned i'll be back
I finished with two baskets, one with the dark color and one on the kind of like a pastel color. So let me show you. So this is the first basket that I get it done. Remember that I show you that I had to put this one together again. So I did this cotton yarn and here's the first on uh, the acrylic. Here's one, here is two, here is three. And remember, I'll just show you about putting the, um, this in each of the skin cake that I did today. And here is the last one. And this, this, this is, a, this is a more of the big one that I did. So this is the, um, pastel color done. I got my basket in here for I'm gonna put the dark colors now this one I put a gray in the middle you can see and I just put the other rest the one because it was too remember that I show you it was too small on these colors so you know what let me put it just together and I left this one just like that because this one this could be over there in the wall so I'm not gonna put that and also the um if I had a space I will put all the cakes over there, but the pens is I have a space, and and I put all the just like that because I am not going to control whatever they go they go, and here is all the colors, this beautiful, and here is the last one, so um, yeah, so let me continue because I got the next. I got the big bag that I need to do, and it's this one right here. So let's see what is in here. Oh boy! Oh boy! I know there's a lot. So oh boy! So empty bag. And let's work it. Let me show you. Let me show you how to look. All these big mess. Here is all the stash yarn. All the yarn that I go be put it together. And see how it's going to be completely done. This is the mess right now. The bag is empty now there's no more in here on this bag is just amazing it feels so good you can see there's no scrappy yarn like all the big mess like I use it in here that what it was it was looked like you know when I put it just here on the table where you see it so so ready to when I have more yarn that you know some I just leave it like this 
um because it was kind of the last pieces and also i just i don't want to put it like this one right here they had the same color but i was just like okay <laughs> i'm tired you know it was it was really long day to do this and i said i need to do it because there's a lot of projects this could be in part number two there's gonna be another video that i'm going to use all these kind of yarn so in project so and here's another color you can see i mean it's not like you know whether or not i did i'm not trying kind of organize the colors or like get magic colors Whatever it was, it gone together, just like that. You see it. So, I mean, yeah. <clears throat> and so I got some, some mandala like this. It was two different kind of mandalas. So um, I just put it together. And this one right here, this is another one. I'm pretty sure, I'm really like this one. This one can, you know, um, well, this one, you already see this one. So, um, all the dark colors, a color like this. Oh, this is going to be good together and something, you know. So, like I said, this, I put it, I leave it just something like this. And also, and it was kind of like this yarn and it was, I don't want to put it in, you know, in case. I'm probably, I'm going to do just maybe, I mean, crochet and some, uh, you know. That yarn, this one right here, because this one is different kind of colors. But see some like this, they have black, pink, and and I just put these ones together because they had the uh, the metal, not the metal, um, or the shiny part. You see, this is um, I think if I'm not mistake, it's not red car. I'm not sure it is not red car. Is mainstay from Walmart. You know the the three colors. I think like three or four more. I think it's red card. I'm a hundred percent sure. And I got some like this chunky yarn. And look at this one right here. I just put all the extra colors that I have. And I said, well, let's see. And it can be a small project, a to uh, a toy like uh, amigo Rumi, whatever. You know, something that's small that I can use. And also, I put these two together. Um, let's see what else. And I think that's pretty much. Oh, and the last one that is going to be the pastel colors. And, you know, kind of these colors like this. Some like this can go. All these, I'm going to look at which one. But I think all right there that I just show you first is dark colors. And this one is more light colors. And like this one. And also this one is cut. Now, so, yeah. So I got two baskets so everything is going on the big on the big back tote to back like that i just try to organize now if i have more space and the wall i will put a sum over there but if it's not it will be everything on on the on the big old the big bag that i show you in the beginning that it was a lot yarn in there so it was not a lot but you know you know what i mean um so Part number two, wait for part number two. This one is just gonna be get ready because there's gonna be a lot of good ideas that I will go bring them with you and what I'm gonna be crochet, what I'm gonna be, um, and it's gonna be a big project or there could be a small project, easy, quick to do it. So get ready your scrappy yarn, get this work, and you can see I got my yarn already. So see you in the video number two. And um, our, we're looking for more pictures. I already have some pictures ready. Get it done. I mean, get it done in the way I uh, will show you in the, in the part number two. So um, have a wonderful and beautiful and amazing yarn day. Bye.